guys welcome to my channel i just received my order at ulta yesterday and today um i order only once but they have three separate shipping this are the two that arrived yesterday i already unboxed them i already unboxed them and then i went to the store because the first package have a broken eyeshadow like i said ulta is very expert in shipping broken packages anyway the one that got broken is this one so i went to the store and have them replace it and i also bought um two lip liner one in uh see it's a different color the lightest one is flesh and the other one is cafe this is by both la girl and so is this this is in the shade juicy the broken part is this two yesterday the two shimmery ones so i went to the store and i decided to get this one the Forever Flawless by Revolution, the ad ad adventuring, adventuring, and unfortunately, this is also part of my order, so I didn't know that I have this already. I got this at the store, and my order arrived today, so I got two, which is okay, because I love greens anyway. I might be giving this to my friend. And also, I went to Walgreens, and I got myself this chocolate, and this nice uh, honey roasted cashew, and this, um, I'm not a fan of Wet n Wild, the only, I mean Wet n Wild mascara, the only Wet n Wild mascara that I ever liked was the one from Red Rock, when he launched this, um, uh, I think, um, a palette, and a mascara, and some the product i i know I, I the hawaiian thing and i like the mascara on that one so i decided to give them a try because i heard a good review on this this lady that i've seen it uh use this one is into high-end makeup but she said she likes this one so this is the waterproof mega length mascara in very black it's a boost length mascara mega length so we're gonna try that she also like this uh, two L um, glossy lip stain in uh, cinnamon, cinnamon dream. So I got myself two because so, I'm into this shade. See, that's the shade. And also, um, let me start with my haulage. I got this um, makeup tool by. Uh, J Cat Beauty. It's the lash applicator helper. And then I finally decided to get my hand on this um, Super Stay 24 Hour Skin Tint with Vitamin C. This one is uh, full of eyeshadow when when it arrived. Like I have to clean it. Because this one have all the shadow, the shadow. So this is in the shade. Um, oh no, it doesn't show. Two two zero. Two two zero. And I also try. I wanna try this um, Ultra Beauty Youth Glow Serum Drops Foundation. In the shade light to medium neutral, and this is how it looks like. And I got, I already got this at the store on my last um, video. I got this uh, shade C10, and I didn't know I ordered two. I didn't realize, so I got another two concealer. I think this two are lighter, very light, so light in fact, in C5 and C6. So I might just mix it when I have a darker foundation. And I, I just cleaned this one. Oh my God, I just cleaned this one. See, it's flat because it was all over here on the cover. This is the LA Girl Velvet Blush in the shade dreamy 
And uh, this one, I already have this one, the Blush Bomb by Makeup Revolution in Dolly, Ro Dolly Rose. So I decided to get the rest of them. This wasn't on sale when I got this one. It, it was the end of the sale already, so it's, it's fine. I decided to get this uh, Blush and Highlighter Glow by Makeup Revolution. This is Flushing Pink and Champagne Shine. So, I will just watch it when I use it. Like the other side is, uh, let me, let me, let, let's see how it looks like. Let me open this. Stay sealed. Oh, annoying. I was so mad when I went to the store yesterday because it's so shattered. And the last time I returned a broken package, they even charged me for a tax. So I thought they're gonna do the same again yesterday. So I told them I'm not paying for any tax at all because that one is paid. That I already paid the tax for that. This is the packaging. It's very cheap looking. This is the highlighting shade, which is really dark, and the blush. Wow, what a dark highlighter. Or maybe I just use this as a, as a liquid eyeshadow and then put the same shade on top. That one is in uh, flashing pink. And this one is in uh, champagne shine. So I have to open the packaging. So annoying. Oh, this one is this one is a uh, brighter pink but the highlighter is lighter I'm very curious about the highlighter I want to swatch it hold on very curious how are you gonna hmm. That's how it looks like. Ugh. That's so dark to be a highlighter. Maybe if you want bronzy, bronzy looking skin, like add a little glow, this will be fine. But once blended, it's fine actually. Yeah, it's so golden, see? And it's not glittery, so that's a good thing. See, this is the one I used to clean the blush. The one that's all over the cover. Next time, if I like that blush, I'm gonna buy more in the store. Because I'm gonna have this uh, exchange. Anyway, see, I got two of them. So I'm gonna have one of them exchange. Oh, so annoying. Hmm. Nice shade. If it's all neutral, I would I would keep it, but it's all too much green. I don't I don't I don't need a lot of greens. See those are all the shades. So I will be exchanging it for something else. Maybe tomorrow after work. So a few more things to go. I also ordered this um, Ring Light Revolution Glow Ultra Glow Highlighter. This is so pretty and big. I remember my, I have a Tom Ford um, brush this, this big in a cherry container. I, I, I don't know, I don't know where it was. 
but it was as big as this one. And this is how it looks like. Oh, so pretty. Mm. So if you have a mat foundation, I mean, a mat, a mat, a mat, a mat bronzer, and you want it to be glowy, maybe you could try that um, stick from uh, Makeup Revolution, and then use a bronzer on top. I don't know. Maybe it will work. Who knows? So on my recent video, I I tried this. Um, where is it? I've tried this um LA cream blush in uh, Kiss Up, so I decided to get this two. Again, this is in Rosebuds and Grace. So this is uh that's how it looks like. A little peachy and really pink. This is my LA girl. I also um like I said I already have the other one. So I decided to get the rest of them. I also have some Juvia's place by the way. See, this is my Juvia's place. So I wanna do a comparison of that one on my Juvia's place. This is eighteen dollars, this is nine bucks. So we'll see and test it out. I'm gonna get the closest similar shade and then we're gonna do a side by side. Anyway, the shade is in Peach Filter. Oh my god, so sealed. Let me open it. I like this color, it's very peachy. See? It's like a very bright peachy shade and if you see if you notice my arms are get I, i'm trying to use a tanning lotion to match my hands because my uniform is long sleeve so every time i come home from work this one is the only exposed one so see my hands are darker than my my hands are darker than my arms so i'm trying to use a, a tanning lotion to even it out <laughs> anyway let me open this I cannot wait to do some makeup and I'm so oh I have another one I also have this shade blissful so I have blissful I have grace and I have the rosebud and the one I got from Target the kiss up so I have four different shade this is a cream blush by LA girl like I said, in case you don't know, I mean to blush right now. How did I open this already? So hard. See, I don't have nails, so it's hard to open this. Oh my god. They got it cooled down now. The, the last few days, it's really extremely hot. So I'm glad the weather is still hot, but it's a little windy. So it's okay. Oh my god. And also the reason why I haven't been doing makeup lately like I used to. Because sometimes even if I just got home from work I would do some makeup. But lately I'm not doing that because I want to spend my time with Charlie. Charlie is my oldest hamster. And I might lose him anytime. So I want to spend my day with him. So anyway this is in the shade... Glam orange. It doesn't look orange to me. The writing is orange, but this one is not really orange. I don't I don't think that's orange. And the other one is in Salvage Coral. This doesn't look coral either. It looks more like a Barbie pink. And I know I I have this already, I just couldn't find it. So I wanna try I wanna try my Bravo Tamer Brow Tamer Balm Kit. I think this is clear. I hope it is. Where's my open one? I couldn't find. I know I have one of these. Let me see. I know I do. 
Because I've seen this before. Let me open it. I told you it's clear and I know I do have it already I want to know if it's as good as my Anastasia and Elf because I both have Anastasia and Elf the clear one and I want to try this Elf Camo oh my god I thought it's a lipstick when I saw it this one is the Camo color correction in orange for my dark on the eye circle I also have one from uh, Black Radiance, one in, shade is this, one in, the heck, where's the color? One in orange, and one in, oh my god, I took out the packaging so there's no shade anymore. That's not right. I think it's... I forgot the shade. Oh wow, I can I can find the shade. The shade is in the packaging. So once you take out the packaging, you cannot see it anymore. That's stupid. So what if you want to repurchase this and there's no shade? Well, I made a haulage video on this and I mentioned the, the name of the packaging. I mean, the name of the shade. And I also tried this um, Four Super Dewy Blush by Makeup Revolution. This is in the shade Flushing For You. Flushing for you. Fake the flush. This one is really dark and I want to try it. Uh, this one is blush me up. And the other one is a little broken, see? So I cannot read it. Hold on. You got me blushing. Well, Ulta, you didn't get me blushing. You got this broken, see? Anyway, two last items. This is from... Makeup Revolution that I'm hoping that I don't have yet. Um, this one is the Ultimate Desire in the shade Into the Bronze. I have Ultimate Desire, I have the Ultimate Limits, I have the Ultimate Nudes. So, I hope I don't have it yet because I have a few. Sometimes I get so confused I, I, I buy the same thing but it's okay. Like I said, if it's neutral ones, I don't mind keeping it, see? Because I can work with this with any palette that I have especially mixing it with the bright ones that I have so this is the most expensive one I got this is I, I don't know if it's 35 or 39 dollars the color pop smoking hot palette the press powder palette press powder palette yeah press powder palette and I was so happy when I saw it that nothing is broken I just wish they have a mirror because you know it's thirty five bucks. You you know the 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 one I got from uh the one I got from uh Profusion don't have mirror but at least they have a brush. This one don't have any, so I cannot wait to test this out. So let me just dry my hair because it's still a little wet. And we'll be doing makeup. I wanna, I wanna try this next palette that I have. This one, the Profusion Dreamscape. I already did a look using this Adventurous. See, like I said, I always clean my brush every use, so my brush is clean. Anyway, that's how my haul is from Ulta. Thank God I only have one broken item, but still, you're an expert in. Um, giving me broken packages. Oh, anyway, thank you again for watching. See you again next time. And I'll be back for a makeup look. Bye.